What's the YouTube terror? Back to the video in today's YouTube video. I'm gonna show you guys how to install the Proto Manly's weather mod for Modrinth and Curse Forge. This YouTube video shouldn't be long at all. You guys should be out of here in about five to 10 minutes. I'm gonna go through every single set to install this mod for you guys. And uh, first thing in this video, we're gonna start with the Modrinth and then transition over to Curse Forge for the installation process, man. But yeah, I got timestamps in the description and in this video. If you guys wanna go ahead and skip all the way over to Curse Forge installation. Now, I think Modrinth is a little bit better than Curse Forge. It is because it's so much easier to install this mod and a whole lot more simple so so yeah we're gonna go ahead and get started with mod rent installation i don't want to make this video too long so let's go ahead and get started all right guys so the first thing you want to go ahead and do is head to the description down below and go down and you guys want to hit this mod with download link now you guys don't have to do this step if you guys already have mod rent installed but some people don't have mod rent installed so i'm gonna go to this website right here first link in the description below and we're gonna hit the download the mod rent app button right here and we're gonna put this in our downloads folder so we can find it later and delete it after we're done installing it and we're gonna press save I'm on a Chromium browser, so it'll pop up in the top right, but maybe on another side of your screen. But we're gonna go ahead and press this modernthapp.exe right here. Hit next. We're gonna hit next again. And it will be installed in our C drive. Let's hit the next button right here. And then we're gonna run Modern app. If you, this is optional, but I'm gonna go ahead and make a desktop shortcut so I can find it easier later. And all right, guys, we got the mod that I've already installed. Very, very simple process. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and make our mod pack and so I can show you guys how to install the mod. We're gonna hit this plus icon right here, create new instance. We're gonna hit custom, you can name it whatever. I'm gonna do example. Then we're gonna go to NeoForce because this is what the mod is on. Game version, we're gonna do 1.21.1. That's the version that this mod is made on. And uh, yeah, so make sure your loader is on NeoForce and your game version is on 1.21.1. Now press create and let that go ahead and install. All right guys, so after when that is done installing, it should pop up on the left side of your screen here or you can find it in the library section of the mod pack you just created. Now let's go ahead and go to this mod pack right here or you can just go on the left side and click example, whatever you named yours. And then now you're on the home screen of your mod pack. And the only thing you gotta do now is go to install content and then search up the Proto Manly's weather mod. Just like that, press the install button and you are good to go. And now if you guys already have a mod pack made for mod rent, this is even a lot easier just to do it. But yeah, so very, very simple, very, very easy, man. But before we go to the Curse Forge uh, installation guide, guys, I will be releasing an FPS boost guide for this mod because this mod is very, very demanding. But yep, in that video, guys, I just teach y'all some ways to increase your FPS, show you guys how to properly configure your mod pack, mod list, and everything like that. So once that video comes out, I'll pin it in the comment section below and I'll put it in the description too and probably make a card in the top right of your screen. All right, guys, so I already have Curse Forge already installed on my PC. I'm not gonna go through the, the setup because most of y'all already have it installed and uh, it's just about the same thing as modern. So just make sure y'all install the standalone version, not the overall version. It's pretty simple for Curse Forge as well. So which first thing you wanna do, guys, is make your mod pack real quick. So go to Minecraft, make sure Minecraft is installed. You're gonna create a mod pack and name the profile name again. So I'm gonna do example once again. Make sure the Minecraft version is 1.21.1. Make it NeoForge and make sure it's the latest NeoForge uh, model version. Press create right here and it will start installing Minecraft, uh, NeoForge, and all of its dependencies. But in the meantime, while that is installing, we're gonna go ahead and go to our browser and we're gonna go ahead and go to Proto Manly's Weather Mods website on Modern. Now this will be also be in the link in the description below, but uh, I know this is Modern's website, but we can still get its jar file because this mod is not uploaded on Curse Force. So we're gonna have to use Modern's jar file to uh, make this work on Curse Force. So we're gonna hit this download button right here. And then we're gonna get the latest version right here. And we're gonna press this down. We don't wanna install with Modern app because we're on Curse Force. We just wanna get that jar file of this latest version right here so press the download button right here and we're going to save it to our download so we can find it easily all right guys our curse forge installation just got done and uh, yeah we're gonna go ahead and drop the proto manly's weather mod into this mod pack so first thing you want to do is go up to three dots in the corner right here i'm gonna go to open folder and then we're going to find our mods folder right here. Now it's empty because we haven't installed anything in it yet. We're going to go ahead and go and right click on our download section right here. This is where we installed the jar file. You can press open a new window. And we're going to put these right windows right beside each other. And here is our PM weather proto Manly's weather mod jar file, the latest version as of recording this video. So what we're gonna do is drag it all the way over to the mods folder. And yep, that's basically all you gotta, guys gotta do. That's it, very, very simple installation and uh, very, very easy. Now it's not gonna pop up 
in this mod section because it's not an official mod on Curse Forge, but it should still work. You guys don't need any other dependency mods. Maybe you guys want to install just enough items and some other mods in there. You can go ahead and do that. Essential, you guys can go ahead and do that. But yeah, guys, that is it for an installation video, man. It shouldn't even be that long. It should be like a six minute video at max, or maybe even less than that after I get done editing. But yeah, guys. But yeah, guys, if you guys have any more questions, leave them in the comment section below and I go ahead and respond. And you guys can go ahead and join my Discord server too. If you guys have a more of like a deeper question you guys want to ask me, you guys can go ahead and send me a DM on Discord and join my server. And uh, yeah, pretty simple video here, guys. Also, guys, before heading off the video, don't forget about the the FPS boost guide video I have coming out right after this video I'll let you guys know immediately once that video comes out because guys I give you guys so many tips to increase your FPS with this mod this mod is very very demanding on your PC but yeah guys thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video peace out